Did you bring it? Where's the Shadow Broker? Where's Fist? They'll be here. Where's the evidence? No way. The deal's off. I knew I couldn't trust him. Were you hurt in the fight? I know how to look after myself. Not that I don't appreciate the help. Who are you? My name's Shepard. I'm looking for evidence to prove Saren's a traitor. Then I have a chance to repay you for saving my life. But not here. We need to go somewhere safe. We could take her to the human embassy. Your ambassador will want to see this anyway. You're not making my life easy, Shepard. Firefights in the wards, an all-out assault on Korra's den, do you know how many... Who's this? A Quarian? What are you up to, Shepard? Making your day, Ambassador. She has information linking Saren to the Geth. Really? Maybe you better start at the beginning, Miss... My name is Tali. Tali Zora Naraya. We don't see many Quarians here. Why did you leave the flotilla? I was on my pilgrimage. My rite of passage into adulthood. I've never heard of this before. It is a tradition among my people. When we reach maturity, we leave the ships of our parents and our people behind. Alone, we search the stars, only returning to the flotilla once we have discovered something of value. In this way, we prove ourselves worthy of adulthood. What kinds of things do you look for? It could be resources like food or fuel, or some type of useful technology, or even knowledge that will make life easier on the flotilla. Through our pilgrimage, we prove that we will contribute to the community, rather than being a burden on our limited resources. Tell us what you found. During my travels, I began hearing reports of Geth. Since they drove my people into exile, the Geth have never ventured beyond the Vale. I was curious. I tracked a patrol of Geth to an uncharted world. I waited for one to become separated from its unit. Then I disabled it and removed its memory core. I thought the Geth fried their memory cores when they died. Some kind of defense mechanism. How did you manage to preserve the memory core? My people created the Geth. If you're quick, careful, and lucky, small caches of data can sometimes be saved. Most of the core was wiped clean. But I salvaged something from its audio banks. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. That's Saren's voice. This proves he was involved in the attack. Saren won't get out of this one. Wait, there's more. Saren wasn't working alone. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. And one step closer to the return of the Reapers. I don't recognize that other voice, the one talking about Reapers. I feel like I've heard that name before. According to the Memory Core, the Reapers were a hyper-advanced machine race that existed 50,000 years ago. The Reapers hunted the Protheans to total extinction, and then they vanished. At least, that's what the Geth believe. Sounds a little far-fetched. The vision on Eden Prime. I understand it now. I saw the Protheans being wiped out by the Reapers. The Geth revere the Reapers as gods the pinnacle of non-organic life, and they believe Saren knows how to bring the Reapers back. The Council is just going to love this. The Reapers are a threat to every species in Citadel's space. We have to tell them. No matter what they think about the rest of this, those audiophiles prove Saren's a traitor! The Captain's right. We need to present this to the Council right away. 
What about her? The Quarian? My name is Tali. You saw me in the alley, Commander. You know what I can do. Let me come with you. I thought you were on your pilgrimage. The pilgrimage proves we are willing to give of ourselves for the greater good. What does it say about me if I turn my back on this? Saren is a danger to the entire galaxy. My pilgrimage can wait. I'll take all the help I can get. Thanks. You won't regret this. Anderson and I will go ahead to get things ready with the Council. Take a few minutes to collect yourself, then meet us in the tower. Thank <laughs> you.